Hello. Well, Peter Mayhew, the actor who played Chewbacca in Star Wars, passed away April 30th. Um, he was 74 years old. And uh, it appears he had a heart attack and passed away. Um, survived by his wife and three children. Um, he was in five of the movies, um, three through seven, going chronological, and he was a, what was it, consultant, Chewbacca consultant for uh, episode eight, and uh, Solo. Yeah. As of now, no word if he had anything to do with episode nine, I'm not going to say he didn't, but yeah, yeah. Uh, he apparently retired playing Chewbacca due to health issues. Um, and um, yeah, he yeah, he's seven foot three. Yeah, from everybody who, what everybody has said about him, he was uh, one of the nicest people you'd ever meet. Um, always pleasant to uh, cast and crew members, fans. Um, he also worked at a, as an orderly at a, a hospital before he uh, was in Star Wars. Um, but, it's very unfortunate, um, you know, uh, the actor who voiced Admiral Akbar, whose name is escaping me right now, um, we'll look here. Eric Versafield, uh, he, uh, he, uh, Kenny Baker, and Carrie Fisher all, all died in 2000, um, 2016, um, um, but yes, it is a very, it's very sad that he's passed away. Also, John Singleton, the director of various films uh, and producer, various films. Um, uh, I think, if anything, he, he wrote him best known for uh, *Boys in the Hood*, um, which he wrote and directed. You know, he was an incredible filmmaker, and um, he got nominated for Oscars for writing and directing that film. Um, he also made *Poetic Justice*. Um, Did Rosewood, uh, Shaft, the remake, Too Fast, Too Furious, Four Brothers, um, Baby Boy, Higher Learning. And he made some great films also. Um, and he passed away <laughs> um, after um, suffering a stroke. Uh, was in a coma, and, uh, well, I don't know if this was reported he was in a coma, but his doctor, or daughter claimed otherwise, um, but he was, uh, removed on life support and died not long after, and, uh, yeah, it's just very sad that he passed away suddenly. Um, you know, May 6th, you know, today, uh, 
that I'm uh, really, uh, uh, recording this and hopefully should be uploaded. Real shame. Two, two, two people in the film industry are now gone. Um, one who made some of the most certainly important films. A lot of the social commentary that didn't try and you know shove an agenda, just try to you know show reality of their ish, the reality of their. Uh, you know, various topics of whatever was, um, whatever his film's uh, subject matter contained, be it Boys in the Hood or Baby Boy. Um, he, um, uh, he'll be remembered through his film just as Peter Mayhew will re be remembered as Chewbacca um, and, uh, and how he got the job as Chewbacca was George Lucas met him he just stood up and he looked at him and thought said yeah and you're hired it's, you know, that's an uh, incredible um, you know that's a <laughs> great <laughs> way to get a job with anything just stand up and don't have to audition or anything. Um, and apparently it was Peter Mayhew's idea to play Chewbacca as somebody who doesn't really talk, just growls, because George Lucas originally had it, so he spoke lines, but he, Peter Mayhew thought otherwise. And he uh, took that took what he uh, suggested and implemented in the movie. Um, but yes, he will be remembered as Chewbacca through all the various little films he was in, as well as on uh, the holiday special, which many uh, uh, aren't fond of. Um, And he was also in an episode of The Clone Wars as Chewbacca, so that's quite interesting. John Singleton, no, I mean, for two Oscars. I think he should have won for a screenplay for Boys in the Hood. Um, Thelma and Louise won. Well, that's a fine film. Uh, Boys in the Hood, I think, uh, was a better written movie. Well, that's just me. He lost a director to Jonathan Demme for Silence of the Lambs, so I can't be upset. I can't be upset with that decision, though I do believe he should have won an Oscar for screenplay. Um, both of these people, uh, both of these men, have had a huge impact and influence in the film industry. That they're really. Again. <clears throat> so that's all I really have to say. Rest in peace to Peter Mayhew and John Singleton. They, uh, they will be remembered for all their the work they've done in film and television. Um, and they will be missed. Missed by their fans and their family. But they will not be forgotten. And with that, I shall leave you. And I hope you all have a good day, good week. See you next time.